2013. So, of course, Thailand off to the flying start that they so wished for in the form of Arachinov Intanon winning the women's singles. Next up, of course, is men's singles, then mixed doubles, and hopefully we'll get as far as men's doubles as well. Because, of course, the first semi-final was done and dusted after three matches. So, to the men's singles. And it's Tommy Sugiato of Indonesia up against the left-handed Tanonsak Sansombunsak from Thailand. So the 24-year-old from West Jakarta, number 18 in the world ranking at the moment, has been as high as 16. 24-year-old, and although he'll turn 25 at the end of next month. Now, he's played two matches so far in this Asiata Cup campaign. And he played against Thailand. He played against his opponent of today. He's played twice. He's won twice. So to his opponents, the left-handed 22-year-old from Thailand, Tanang Muksuk, Sansom Boonsak. And of course caused a sensation this year at the All England Championships because as a qualifier he went all the way through to the semi-final. Lost out to the world number one, the Lee Chong Wei. And of course the Malaysian Lee Chong Wei became a father yesterday. Congratulations to him and his wife, Wong Mu Chu, with the safe arrival of baby son Kingston. Well, of course, when they met each other on day five of competition in the Atsiada Cup, Tommy Sugiato, son of the former world champion, Ichuk Sugiato, who, of course, won the world title in 1983 in Copenhagen, beating the great Liam Sui King in the final. Well, there he is. That's Sugiato Jr., and some boonsuck. Well, the first time I really took notice of the left-handed Thai player was when he beat former World Olympic champion Taufik Hidiat twice in a week. 
That was during the Southeast Asian Games in Jakarta of 2011. And of course, Samsung Bunsa reached the final of the men's singles and therefore got the silver medal. But the All England performance by the left-hander I think must rate as his best performance so far. Well, he's played in six previous matches, has Sansom Boonsuk, as we look at our court officials, both of them from Malaysia. Of course, six matches he's played so far. Didn't play against Europe. Boonsuk Ponsana played on day six, played men's singles and men's doubles, incidentally, Boonsak that day. But apart from that, Tanong Sak Sansom Boonsak has played all other matches and he won four of them. Lost to Asia's Lee Hunil and lost to this man, Tommy Sugiata, as well. Apart from that, a left hander a very good record in this campaign so far. So this is the fourth meeting between these two players. The last time they met, of course, was won by Sugiata in this Asiata Cup, Cup competition. Prior to that, it was the All England quarter-final last month when Sensum Boonsuk won that encounter in two straight games, as I say, as a qualifier, before losing in that semi-final. So the last two encounters, one win apiece, and both of them in straight games. men's singles and absolutely crucial as far as Indonesia are concerned the defending champions but of course Thailand are already one love up in the overall tie one Good rally. Yeah. Very good rally. Service over. One, four. towards the line as the left hander as if to save himself I don't think I should have played it I think he was going wide yeah but there's a little point
Oh, he's missed another one. Goodness me. Oh, there's no doubt in his talents. And after that silver medal at the Southeast Asian Games in Jakarta in 2011, it was almost, I don't know whether this is true or not, but it appeared to me as a spectator that he almost became a little complacent or even arrogant that he had meddled in a major games and I've always thought he's got such talent, but he's never seemed to really fulfill that talent. Not until New Orleans, England last month. He really has to work with him, whereas at this level, he's not going to be given easy points. Short. Yeah, well worth rally from Tommy Subiato. Six, two. Frustration about some some being stuck. Oh. Puzzled as well, scratching his head. Oh, what have I got to do here? Oh, that's an easy point. Savi Sova, three, seven. because he hit the earlier one long and he just did his shot and that was just inside the back line. Savisova, 5-8. Short. Yep, got what it deserved. And he's going to look well. He's still shaking his head. Should be pleased with himself Six, in that way. There's signs of frustration a little earlier, and it's good to take his time, calm himself down, get clear in your own mind what the game plan is. As long as you don't take too long, there's a very fine line between sensible tactical awareness and gamesmanship, which just crosses over that line of taking a little too long. could afford to play a little hold and flick from this end of the court because the shuffle will hold up. It's quite clear he wants to try and dominate the net. Poor Sibirato to miss. Sub is over. A strong Seven, possibility nine. has happened in that rally that he's going to lift long. Very good 
good lift and that tight spin neck shot. Service over. He's a real character. Is then on the sack. Where's his hold on his sleeve? Yeah, I like to see the expression from players. Not being rude or aggressive to opponents or officials. He's just chastising himself. I yeah, don't mind that. Serve. Nine, ten. It's going to go wide. Yeah, well wide. And it's all level. Who's going to have the psychological ten, advantage four. at the mid game interval? Service over, 11, 10, in cover. Just one solid three points in it. Very strong athlete is Tommy Sugiato, just like his father. Twenty seconds. Last week with friend of mine. And of course, the Yak Vilna. Great racing. Damien Green Hill, also from Formula One. Eleven, ten. Johan Cruyff, Nordic Cruyff, Dutch footballers, but there's not many. Simply the court, both players are yeah, very wary of the other being able to create angles if they hit out wide. Almost the entire rally there.
turn of serve. Does struggle sometimes, does the left hand up with the pushes 13, 11. Directly straight at him. A little tactical awareness from Subiato. He looks awkward on defense only when it's close to the body. Service over 12 13. One million US dollars prize money on offer. And the team will take home 400,000 US dollars. Finalists. Oh, what good net play. And oh, the net exchange won by Sansom Boomstar. 40, 30. And the big finalists, 200,000. Third place finishes, 150,000. Fourth place. Finishes a hundred thousand US dollars. Every team in the semi final stage guaranteed at least hundred thousand US dollars. Yeah, the lift, very good, then the block, and then the attacking play. And did very well on the lift, control it, and not hit it long at the back line. It's 14 all. The score is actually 15-14. It really is nip and tuck all the way. Ah! Well, Sugiato immediately looks towards the umpire as if to appeal the call. No overall, and I think we Umpire and the line judge were correct. Yeah, that looked in to me. Stage of the opening game. Yeah. 
Oh, my goodness, how quick was that? 18, 40. Well, you see, sir, and the anticipation like that, one can understand exactly why and how he reached the All England semi final. That was superb. So, too, was that. 19, 14. Straight points from 14 all. All of a sudden, these two points away from the open game. Look at that athleticism. What a joy to watch. It is time. Some some boom. Sub is over. Twenty. Ten point. Fifteen. For the right opportunity. Right around the head smash. Means that he now has five game point opportunities. Second time of asking a little clinch fist there. First game won by Tainan Sack. Coming from behind in the opening game. 4 8 down he was at one stage. And he takes game number one. 21 16. Well, he'll be delighted with that. and gentlemen, it's been a fantastic day here at the ICA Dark Cup semi-finals. Everyone's all pumped up. Are you excited, Gila? Yeah, I'm excited because Indonesia is playing now. So. so I'm guessing you're supporting Indonesia, aren't you? Yeah, of course I'm from Indonesia, so I'm supporting Indonesia. Okay, unfortunately, Indonesia is not doing too well so far. So do you have any words of encouragement for Tommy? Uh, the, uh, the game is not over yet, so... I'm pretty confident that he will win this, this game. All right, Tommy, there you have it. Words of encouragement for you. You have a big, big fan here who's just waiting for you to win the man's single. Well, that's all we have for now. Let's head back to the game, shall we? Well, Tommy Subiato will himself be well aware of just how vital this match is. Now, just to remind seconds. everyone that it's four matches per tie. So if the two teams are tied at two matches, one each, then we go down to the number of games won. And if we're still equal after that, then it goes to the number of points won. Now, just to put that into perspective, if Thailand in the second form of Tanon Samsung Boon Suk was to win this second game now, of course they will have won two matches and they will have won both their matches in two straight games. All Thailand would need, if that happens, 
would be to win one more game one in one of the remaining two matches. Well, that puts a little bit of clarity on it, doesn't it? That's why left-hander looks so fired up right now. Because, of course, Indonesia are the defending champions. Oh. It's only the second year of the Axiata Cup. And what a Two popular left. event it's proved to be. And the format this year with four matches and with every match within a tie, counting towards the team score. Oh, it's just been a wonderful innovation into the sport. Service over. One, two. Well taken from Subiato. Two, oh. Oh, that's a lot of the Three, Left hand has got to realise about the drift. Pretty well near the double service line. And we're near the back of the court. So you can see once again where the shuffle was landing as far service as depth over. Three, was concerned. Oh. Once again, it was near that double service line. as ever. Hold on. The young pet Charapon to give him his full name. No, mustn't try and force it too much. Young left hander. Five, three. Good work for the points, went for the right opportunity. Got a little bit of feather in the eye there. Service over, four, five. Exactly well, this is tempted that cross court slash. Found the hit as a winner in the last two occasions. Oh. No. Quick reaction, Sidiato, I think momentarily just forgetting Six, his opponent five. was a left hander. Aggressive passage of play here from the eight to my left five. hander. Oh, he's paying dividends for him. Five straight points from three five adrift. An eight five advantage. Oh, good net shot. Right idea. Service over, six, 
Well, there's never a dull moment, is there, with Tanon Sak Sun Son Boon Sak? Emotion on court, Tommy Sugiato. Quietly and calmly gets on with the job in hand. Soon about changing shuttles, didn't I? Talking about it earlier on. Tom, Tom, Tommy Sugiato saying, No, I want this shuttle. Nine, eight. So now, four straight points to the Indonesian. Miss, isn't it? You know, it's a superb winner. Well, he goes for the winner and misses it. So, run of five points for the Thailand player, followed by a run of five points by the Indonesian. Well, he had to work so hard for that. Riley did the left hand up. The luck of the net cord helping him on the final shot. Deceptive flick serve. Ten all. Yep. And indeed, it has Eleven, the ten, advantage of the mid game double. interval. Can on sack some some boom suck. Having won the first. It's 11 10 now in the second. How can we think the unthinkable? Oh, one of the fans earlier on saying definitely Indonesia through to the final. Well, not looking that way at the moment, is it? And I'm sure both players, all players within the team, will be acutely aware of the importance of every seconds. single game and not just every single match. And he wears his heart on his sleeve.
into the back corner there. Well, Beautiful yeah. placement. Yeah, a little hold and flick. That was lovely. Yeah, wild attack again. Oh, that's a run of six straight points because he was 8-10 down before the mid-game interval. Wide. Goodness me, that kind of miss by 50, much. 10. Seven straight points and a five point advantage. And one comes to an end. Service over. 11, 15. Sugiato needs to make a tremendous effort here. Once again, to reiterate, if Tanon Sak was to win this men's singles in two straight games, they will have won two matches, won four games, lost no games, which would mean even if Indonesia won the last two matches, they would have to win both those last two matches, the mixed doubles and the men's doubles, in two straight games. It would then all come down to the number of points won and lost. All Thailand would have to do, if they could win this in two straight games, is win one game within the remaining two matches. We're all academic at the moment, because this second game is far from over. Oh, sat on the top of the tape, fell back his side. 40, 50. And Sibiato has closed the five point deficit just to one point. Oh, my goodness, how important so is that over. Guy? 60, 40. Important as far as both teams are concerned. Pushed it wide. Seven. Oh, goodness me. Oh, I tell you, this format creates so much tension. Every point so vital. Oh, that's nice. Oh, my goodness me. I don't believe it. Well, immediately he raises his hand in apology and knows it was good fortune. He was trying to lift the shuttle to the back of the court. It hit the top of the tape and just trickled over. And nothing the Indonesian could do about that. So, Tanon three points away from two game to love. 
victory in this men's singles. Man, that's wild. Got to somehow calm his nerves. 15, Gone wide. And now Thailand, two tantalizing points away from taking this men's singles and getting a two point to love lead in the overall tie. Points opportunities for the left handed Tanom Sak and Sansom Boon Sak. Point opportunities against Indonesia, the defending champions. Done it. Would you believe it? 21 uh, 16, 21 15. And revenge for his uh, defeats a couple of weeks ago. Match won by and Thailand, Thailand are in an incredibly 16, strong 21, position. They are two matches to love up, they're four games to love up. So even if Indonesia win the last two matches all Thailand have to do is win one game if they don't manage to do that it's going to come down to the number of points won or lost but what a performance in the men's singles by Thailand 21-16 21-15 well, really, that was sensational. Absolutely superb performance. Well done. Tanon Sak. I've still got with me Jason, of course, who's going to be my translator. But I have to say, when you lost so badly to Tommy by, what, 12 and 13, I think, last time, what has changed? How did you manage to turn that around? Um, maybe I, I must more training about the power than about offensive and defensive <laughs> but your defense was superb and obviously you put him on the defensive all the time with your drops your power play there was something really special Yes, I, I'm also happy when I win. Yes. Yeah. Uh, I heard that there was a great team talk today. Did that make a big difference? Um, I when I play today, I'm, I am no, no pitcher. Just try my best if I can. Then it's good. Then that is really good for me. Given them, yeah. yeah. Okay, well, uh, can I say hearty congratulations? That was a brilliant performance. Well done. It means that Thailand are in the lead by 2 0. There's still some work to be done, but a great chance to go through to the final to Malaysia tomorrow. Well done. Thanks a lot. Thank you very much indeed. Yes, well, he really did work extremely hard. And of course, he lost to Sugiato. 21 17 21 14 two weeks ago this week in the semi-final when it really mattered you reverse the result and he won 21 16 21 15 and thailand a two love up against the defending champions indonesia Saya Lilian Hatsir dari Indonesia, Anda sedang menonton Aksi Atakap.